I had a, uh, I had another thing where every time I was with a cat, my eyes would just stream and water. I was just so allergic to cats. And I couldn't work out what it was about because I wasn't afraid of cats. But my eyes would just stream water. And then I, after a series of processing emotions, I found, I found within myself that I had a belief that my father, my father has cats. And my father used to, any cat that walked through the yard, he'd just shoot it, right? And, uh, he, yeah, any cat, any cat around my dad does not survive. And so I, when I was very, very young, had this feeling that if I loved cats, my father would not love me. Does that make sense? And once I went through that emotion, I was no longer allergic to cats anymore. You find lots of these relationships when you work through your emotions. All these sort of relationships. I used to have a, I used to lay on a lawn. We used to have couch grass at home, and I used to lay on the lawn, and I'd get all of these allergy spikes. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean, like little pinpricks from the couch grass. Mm -hmm. And um, and like one thing I've realised is that anything that happens to me that doesn't make sense in harmony with God. So in other words, if God created the lawn, God created me, right? Yeah. Then obviously, if the lawn and me are not agreeing, <laughs> there must be an emotion within me that causes that to occur. It's like, if the cat and me are not agreeing, there must be an emotion in me that's created that, you see. And the more you allow yourself to go down that track, the more, the more you release. What you'll find will happen is that you'll get to a point where you realise all of these relationships. And in my case, I'm not allergic to plants anymore, but I used to be. But I had to deal with a lot of different emotions of what caused those allergies. Yeah. And they were all emotional. The whole lot was emotional. Yeah. I used to have a... You know sometimes when you're in a dust storm or you it's a dusty home or whatever, you have the smell of dust? Mm -hmm. You know that smell? And as soon as I had that smell, I would get asthma. Mm -hmm. I used to get asthma as a child until until I was 33 years of age I used to have asthma pretty much constantly and I've been hospitalized a number of times with the asthma uh, as well so I used to have it quite bad and uh, a lot of it was related to any time dust was around bang I got asthma any time there was a wheat, smell, wheat grass smell around I'd get asthma I just had to smell it and I got asthma and uh, and again, I thought, you know, it's just because I've got asthma, I'm allergic to all these things, and I went down that trap for a while, and then started realising it must be all emotional. Once I worked through the connections of what was actually going on, and realised that it was connected to certain events in my life, once I actually allowed myself to experience those events emotionally, because the emotion was just frozen within me, and released those, I no longer have that reaction to dust or to wheat or to any plants like that. Does that make sense? So, mm -hmm. all of them are emotions in the end. Everything. Everything. Is what if it was um, a, a reaction to something man made prescription? Does that apply to you? Well, no. I, no. I often have reactions to man made things. Um, and I, what I've learned from that is that um, man made things are very poisonous to the body. And, and yes, you will need to work through why you want to take something that's poisonous to your body or why you feel you need to take it. What I've found now is that I don't have to take any medication or anything like that, whereas I used to take lots. Um, and I'm, I'm even very sensitive to chemicals in foods now, but that I wasn't sensitive to before. So that's become the opposite as well. The more in harmony with in the natural environment I'm becoming, the less in harmony with the manufacturing environment I've become. Whereas before I was in very much in harmony with the manufacturing environment and the natural environment I would have all these reactions to. Yeah. And that's changed to be the opposite. So you will become more sensitive yeah. um, to, to things that are in disharmony with God as well. And manufacturing chemicals that harm or impact upon the flow of energy in your body is certainly going to cause damage to you. I've never 